getting back on the right track. Welcome into sports, everyone. Antelope Volleyball came out the gates blazing this year, starting out 5-0, but then followed that run by losing four of five games. Tonight, looking to get things in the right direction at home. Rams taking the court here. Antelope welcoming in the Madison Highland Prep Heat into town. Heat with a record of 2-7 and seven entering today. Starting in the first set, Rams up 5-3. Kariyami Arana sets for Matilde Zazueta. Perfect placement there. That gets down for a kill. Antelope extends their lead to 6-3. Rams up 9-6 here. Arana setting again, this time for Jocelyn Alvarez. The return too much to handle for the Heat. Point to Antelope. Make it 10-6. Next point, how about that very same connection? Arana to Alvarez again. The return even better as it stays inbounds. Nice kill from Alvarez. The Rams, their lead grows to 11-6 now. And Arana, she was on point with the setting tonight. This is again a set from her, this time over to Marissa Jimenez, finding room for another kill. Antelope kill would make it 15-9 after that. Rams go on to take the first set 25-17, and Antelope gets back to their winning ways. Rams now at a record of 7-4 on the year. They'll be back in action on Tuesday as they hit the road to take on Salome. Heading over to Eagle Field with the 5-4 Vincent Memorial Scots hosting the Holtville Vikings for some flag football. Vikings still looking for their first win. Last play before halftime, Gala Cervantes back to pass, but her flag pulled for a sack by Camila Sanchez. The Viking defense holding at 8-0. First drive of the second half, Cervantes to throw again, but the pass broken up by Alicia Villagomez. A few plays later, Cervantes to the air again. And this time, she connects with Valentina Lopez for the touchdown. The two-point conversion would then make it 16-0. Next, Scott's possession. It's Cervantes to Lopez again, this time for another touchdown. Vincent rolling in the second, and the pair would connect yet again. Thrice as nice, their third touchdown of the game. Moving on, a creative play here from Holtville. Mia Navarro finding Angie Beltran on the double pass, but it would be Vincent Memorial coming out on top with a big 32-0 win. Now over to Cal Jones Field with the 6-5 Central Spartans hosting the 6-4 Imperial Tigers. Beginning in the first half, Giselle Carrillo dropping back, and here she is. She's going to connect with the receiver. Nice move there. Is enough for the first down. A few plays later, Carrillo throwing right up the seam to Addison Clark, who goes up for the snag. Counted as another Tiger first down. Imperial would end that drive with a turnover on downs. Next possession, Amber Miranda hitting Azul Amador, and... Ooh, take a look at the move there. Amador down the sideline, and, well, she'd eventually be downed at the one-yard line. Next play, Miranda going right back to the center. Emma Islas for the score. Make it 6-0 Central now. Next possession. This is on third down. Garrio. She's going to fire this one up the seam for the Tigers. Complete, but flag pulled just short of a first down. Fourth down here. This one is actually going to be a direct snap to Clark, but Jayla Connor stops her short of the line to gain, so it's a turnover on downs for the Tigers. Central would end up cruising in the rest of this one. 18-0, the final score. That's all the time we have for sports.